Welcome to the second round of Power BI practice in which I present you a challenge at the beginning of the week and then at the end of the week I will walk you through my solution. Now in this round we're going to have a look at measures and calculated columns. Now easy you think? Well I tried to set up a tricky scenario. Let's have a look. Now for this round, we're gonna work with a very small, simple data set where we have the dates, the products, the vendor, and quantity. And what we're interested in is to calculate the share of products for which we have just one vendor. And we're gonna visualize this in a donut chart and it should show that we have two products for which we have just one vendor. That's gonna be product two and product four. And there will be three products for which we have more than one vendor and you're going to approach this challenge in two different ways the first approach is going to be with measures and then you're going to solve the same challenge using a calculated column and this will help you to get a better understanding of tax and to make the donut chart really stand out you're going to build a custom tooltip so that when you hover over let's say the share of more than one vendor it shows only those products and if i over over one vendor it only shows me the products that have one vendor now, of course when you write your DAX formulas it's always helpful to also build tables along the way to see if it works just like the ones that I have over here now for a summary of all the requirements and how to download the data set how to share it and get feedback just have a look at the description box down below and I wish you a lot of luck with this week's challenge. I'm looking forward to all of the submissions.